Yo guys, what's poppin'? It's time for shopping. Back at it with another Black Ops Cold War franchise store video. This one's gonna be for May 9th, a bit late today, so I do apologize. Usually I can't get you guys the item shop on the weekend, but I did go ahead and find some time today. Just got back, so we do have a couple of minutes that I can hop on and record something for you guys. So we got two brand new bundles here today. We did not have anything new yesterday. I did check. Nothing new at all. So we have a brand new reactive camo here, and it looks like it's either for the 74U or the AK-47. That one's going to look pretty cool, I can tell, just by what I'm seeing already. And then we have another blueprint bundle here called Hardwood Hero that we're going to be checking out here as well. As always, make sure you guys leave it a like on the video here today and make sure you are subscribed to the channel. Really do appreciate all the support. Let's hop right into it, man. We have the Angels and Demons Reactive Anime Camo. This one's going to be sick, man. I think this is going to be one of... This, it's for the AK-47. I think it's going to be for one of the uh, probably top contenders of best reactive camel in the game it's definitely going to be um probably for me like top three i think because just by the preview it looks super cool so this one's going to cost you 1800 honestly pretty damn good price on a reactive especially if it's dope so let's hop into it man called cursed angel this one might as well have one of those uh special inspects but it's not a mastercraft it's just a reactive so it might not but always worth checking out wow this thing is amazing this is this is the best one. This is the best one in the game. Besides maybe the Krig with the dragon blueprint, but honestly, I think this one's better. Oh, wow, man. Oh my god, it looks so good. Where was this like when they first dropped the reactive camos? Like this compared to everything else they've done except for the dragon beats it phenomenally. This is this is above 10 of 10. This is like 11 of 10 all day long. This is probably my favorite weapon in the game. Favorite blueprint in the game right now. It's super close between this and the Dragon Krig, but I, I think this one is my favorite. Um, muzzle Break, Takedown Barrel, Spetsnaz Grip, 40 Round Mag, and Speed Tape. Honestly, not a bad build to start out. Cosmetically, looks phenomenal. Thing looks so good. I'm actually in love with it. I, I think it's such a good blueprint. This purple, just, it looks so good, man. Looks so, so good. Um, and then, I'll show you at the bottom. You have your base kills for multiplayer, and then for zombies, it's 50, 100, 150, 200, as per usual. But, in case anybody was curious, um, I'd say that's the best blueprint in the game right now. Top two, and it's not two. So, we're gonna hop into the next one, the M82 Divine Blossom. Tiger Team, CQB Pad. Airborne Elastic Wrap, 7-round mag, and Infiltrator Grip. Some decent attachments on here. Don't let me down. Oh, wow. That's a nice one, too. Man, some really nice blueprints in this one. I like this one a lot. Um, This one's probably top five for me. I, I can't think of anything that would probably place it in, you know, even, even lower. And I definitely like that Frozen one a lot more. And there was another one that looks super sick in the M82. So this one might be top three for me. This one looks really, really good. I still can't get over that AK. It looks so good. So we have good and evil here on the charm. I hope they did a great job with this one. That's cool. I like it. I like that a lot. Is that... I'm wondering if that's half a halo on, like, the angel side. But I'm not sure. Can't really tell from that angle. Angel's Grace. Demon's Lust. And Sword Singer. One more look. One more look. I hope it looks just as good in Warzone as well. My god, man. That thing looks so damn good. And then the fire turns to purple in the final. Oh my god. Such a good one, man. Um, let's wrap it up here today with Hardwood Hero. Check this one out. So this one's going to be 1,300 cob points. This one's called Street Legend for the CQB. Not CQB. QBZ. Get my letters a little mixed up. Ultralight, Barrel, Millstock, Reflex, Marathon, Stock, Jungle Style, Mag, and uh, the Speed Grip. We have Quick Shot there, Hoop Mage. This one's pretty cool, man. I like this one. Kind of giving me some Jordan vibes. With that little design there. Yeah, I like the gray. What What is the, what is it called? Gray Cements, I think. Not huge in Jordans. More of an Adidas person, but... um. I don't even think I own a single Jordan now that I think of it. KSP, Calvary Lancer, 48 round fast mag, mill stop, SAS combat stock, same design, a little bit on the reflex there and on the top of the weapon this time. No love on the barrel or um, 
Actually, that's the only spot that has any blank space. So they did pretty good on these. These are pretty cool. Um, I do like that design. It's not bad. We have ball handles. Halo Hooper. Please load in. Here we go. Slam dunk. And we have Mystical Baller. This actually looks pretty cool. That's sick, man. That's a really cool charm. I like that. I like that a lot. All right, so that one's going to cost you 1,300 cop points here today. That's all that's new in the shop. Uh, if you guys did enjoy this one, man, do me a huge favor. Slap a like on it. Subscribe if you're new. Sponsors and equipment in the description below. We've been killing it on the Tarkov channel as well. ACZFT, link in the description if you guys want to head over there and show some love. I think we're up to uh, almost 1,300 subs over there. The support has been phenomenal. And um, another thing, if you heard my neighbor mowing in today's video, I do apologize. Nothing I can do about it. Uh, just really bad timing, as always. But do me a huge favor. That like is greatly appreciated. I know we haven't had too much content lately. I'm going to be going on a vacation here soon. We're going to be taking pretty much a week off of content. So I'm going to schedule some stuff out for you, but I'm just going to take a little bit of a mental reset break when it comes to the Call of Duty content and stuff. So I'll record some Warzone spectating lobbies and um, a couple other things for you guys. Schedule them out accordingly. But we will be taking a week off of the item shop coming up sometime next week whenever I decide to take a little bit of a break. So we just thought I'd let you guys know ahead of time, but it's going to do it for me. I'll see you guys in the next one. I'm out.